Welcome to Code Pro channel. In this video, I will show you how to download the web pages as a PDF in React.js. Here, I have created a simple demo for you how it will work. So here I have created a simple invoice. When you click on a download button, this invoice has to be downloaded as a PDF. Now let me show you that when I click on this one, it is downloading that entire invoice as a PDF. Here you can see the logo and invoice the same as how it is displaying it in the browser. Let's dive into the code. First of all, I have created a React project with the latest version. So React latest version is 18.2 now. So in this project, I have created a simple component like pdf.js. This contains sample template how you are looking it in the browser. So this is a sample invoice template that I have created with the bootstrap. There is no PDF export functionality not enabled it till yet, but we need to implement for this. Now you can see the code here. This is a functional component that returns the JSX that contains the template that you want to download. Now we are going to implement the PDF export functionality. For that, I have created a step-by-step -step guide that really helpful for you to implement this PDF export functionality. So that step-by-step -step guide is how it looks like is here. If you see that how to download the web pages as a PDF in React, I have created this step-by-step -step guide. So it will tell you that how you need to proceed to implement this functionality. For that, as a step one, it is telling that you need to install these two libraries, the HTML to Canvas and JS PDF libraries. You need to install these two libraries from the command prompt. This is the first step that you need to perform. Once you have downloaded these packages, the second step is you just need to go there here and you can click on next step here. So if you see the next step, it is telling that you need to import these two libraries in your component. Just go and copy and just going to paste it in the our component. So our component is here and here I am pasting it like those two libraries once you have installed you need to import these two things after that you just need to click on the next step here it is telling that create a ref by importing use ref from the react and add the ref to the content that you want to download as a pdf in our case invoice is our content so here i am going to create the ref by copying this and pasting it in the component now, to use the use ref, you need to import it from the React. Once you have created a ref, you need to assign that ref to the content that you want to download by using ref equal to PDF ref. Now the step three is completed. This is the content that you want to download as a PDF. This is the invoice page. After that, in the step four, you need to add a download or a link in your component that trigger the PDF download. I'm just going to copy this function and paste it in the our code. Now I have added a button that will download our web page as a PDF. If you go and see the layout, you will find an error because you have added a click event called download PDF, but you have not declared yet. So for that, you need to go, go to the further step. This is the last step that we need to perform. So here, you know, we have created a function that will handle the PDF download when the button is clicked. So here we are using these two modules for downloading the web pages as a PDF. Here the HTML to canvas, it will take the HTML elements as an input and it will convert that into the image. And we are using the JS PDF module for creating the PDF. So these two modules will work together to generate this PDF. This HTML to canvas which gives the image and the PDF JS PDF will give the PDF. So we need to integrate both the things then it will download that as a PDF. So here these are all the configurations that you need to do. After that the image that was generated by the HTML to canvas that we are going to add to the PDF dot add image. So this PDF was generated from the 
JSPDF library. So here you can see the configurations like JSPDF P is the portrait mode. You can pass it as L as well. That is the landscape mode. This is the dimension. It is the mm. You can pass it uh, different pixels as well. And this is the sheet format, PDF sheet format. It's A4, A1, A2. You can pass it any any kind of sheet that you want to download. And this is for truly for optimization of your PDF. It will reduce the file size. So now we just need to copy this code and paste it in your component. Now if you go and see the layout of your web page, it looks like this. This is the sample template same we have seen before and this is the download button that we have added. In your case, wherever you want, you can add that button there. And now when I click on this button, it is downloading that as a PDF. You can see that it was downloading that as a PDF now. So by this way, we can export the pages as a PDF by using React.js. Here we are using two libraries called HTML to Canvas and JS PDF. And also one thing you need to remember is you should not include SVG images inside this template. HTML to canvas is not compatible to render the SVG images inside this template. So that's why here also I am using that PNG image instead of SVG image. So that's why it is working here. By this way, we can implement the PDF export functionality by using React.js. Thank you for watching the video. If you like the video, don't forget to like and subscribe my channel for more future updates. Thank you.